Oh, that's a lot. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I might just go. Uh, you know what? I will prepare uh, my tea. I'm uh, coming back. Hello, everyone. Thank you for joining. Welcome back to more Epic Auto Towers. I hope you are doing fine. Once again, thank you all for your support. It really means a lot. And special shout out to my first member ever in this channel. It really means a lot if you are watching. Thank you a lot. And that's what is pushing me to inflict into myself what I'm doing here. <laughs> this run took me something around 7-8 hours. I have almost no uh, space left in my uh, PC. I have like two Terra, but I have only like 100 giga octet left. I have been like crazy recording. I have to do some cleaning after this. But anyway, we are not here for that. So previously, when I defeated the game with the Prism, it was only using three towers. I said that this is have a good potential and that's exactly what I did. If you are familiar with my type of video recently i'm just crazy going and breaking the limits so that's what i did and honestly i wasn't expecting this build to do that good and to go that far so as i said i have like seven eight hours of recording i want to be pushing all that like yeah it doesn't make sense i mean it won't be interesting because a lot of time it's all about like re-rolling so i came up with this format it's first time I'm doing this. I have no clue if it will be something that you will appreciate, if it's something that you will like. Well, let me know in the comments if you want me to do it differently because I believe that I will be doing more runs with uh, that many amount of hours of recording. So regarding the format, it will be about step by step how I built the build and then showcasing the build at round 60. So you have an idea how it looks like if ever you want to inflict that much pain to yourself. So you have a way to compare if you are doing it right or wrongly. And then from there, we will just showcase the real deal. And I mean by that fight of level 60, uh, round 60 and beyond. And with that bit said, Let's get to it. So you will need some good RNG as you can see here. By the seventh round, I was already at level two in the prism, multiplying all the infused mana by four. Well Tower was at level three, it was giving me eight mana, and this should just be enough to carry you till the boss. So uh Kaios, I just keep it at one. One reroll is already good enough, and just focusing on getting the well tower as high as possible and infuse the rest of the mana. And once I have the boss, well, I just infuse the rest of the mana because I need to get the dot 100 to be able to defeat it him. Uh, one shot, gone. Uh, lucky enough, get in the stray, <laughs> stay away to heaven. Straight away, that just helps a lot here. Really, really important to get the portal tower. Uh, so I was lucky because I have only one reroll. So if I didn't get it, that will screw up all my plan. I have to redo the run. And from here, same strategy, just continue pushing that Kaios and Well Tower plus the Prism. Once I defeated the second boss, by the way, I got a star token there. It really was a good energy here. I uh, just get another portal uh, so I can get two, as you can see, from the two tower from the, the, the royal set. And make sure to get enough reroll. Uh, here I was checking only one reroll left. And I said, if I don't have it now, I'm done. I have to redo the run. And I was lucky enough, like really, really the last year all I got it. And I buy, uh, like I use star tokens straight away so we can then start giving experience to each other. So from here I was set, I was only missing a last piece. I was thinking about getting another portal tower. But I said, you know what? I don't have a removal token, so let's not do it. And um, yeah, I was just hoping to get the ancient tower to get the forgotten tower and that is exactly what I got This is like 50 50 I believe and from here. I know that I was set because Getting access to the forgotten tower is just mean uh, Infinite star token each turn you can buy one and Then you can just get as many princes as you can I push here Kaios will tower same strategy the portal, I just keep them because I knew that there is the bad boy that nukes all the portal um, that are all the tower that's at level one. They are level one. So I didn't bother getting removal token to take him down because they will do it in my place. And this is how the build look like at level 60. So I have uh, the double tower that's given this uh, absurd <laughs> amount of mana. I think it's quadrillion because you can see I have 411 quadrillion. And then all the Kaios Tower, uh, we have like 60 something reroll here. I stopped here because, man, it's just too 
<laughs> yeah, a lot of work. I mean, having to roll 60 times, it's time, it's turn. Uh, good luck with that. So I said, okay, I stop at 60, it's uh, already good enough. And then from there, I just push uh, as high as possible here. You can see like the prism tower is multiplying everything by 54. That's, that's insane. And yeah, Forgotten Tower, I push it to level 4 so I can just buy its turn um, the champ. I have like 29 now, that's 290% more. And the strategy is really simple. You infuse the mana when I have to, and I mean by that when you have no choice because you might die if you don't do it. Uh, the last time I have infused the mana, I think it was around 40 something. And from there, I just keep in because I know that there is nobody they can hit me for one uh, more than 119 million here. Because the idea is like each time you level up the Prism Tower, you just get in more stats. So that's 20% more. And when you have this like absurd amounts of mana, quadrillion, 20% is just huge. So this is it for the build from now on. What I will be doing is just showcasing the fight of each round from the 60. Uh, around and I uh, will just of course obviously skip in the 60 reroll that doesn't really make sense to to keep it there so let's do it let's go for the round 60 so he will nox everything it's really annoying uh what we got here no this not this one is useless I want a identical tower uh this one is kind of useless as well the first time you buy it round, you can't have more. <laughs> All right, well, 20 mana. <laughs> nope. <laughs> All right, let's go. So here, literally, sorry for the voice. Um, There's not, I'm like getting sick, but not there yet. I hope it gets better. Uh, we just buy, oh, I cannot. Well, uh, then I have to... <laughs> <laughs> 700 quadrillion by the way um yep we push this one uh because i definitely need to get that back now we lost a lot we lost uh, wow damn it he's really annoying that bad boy is really annoying so we have 30 now and yeah there's nothing else uh, we can do here i mean uh, we, uh, we'll be getting this one thanks to this like one comment thanks to this one but i mean is it really worth it to roll 60 times for one tower that might be the one that we want i don't think so so we just end our turn and we go to the 61 and here we go again for yeah now we will start getting uh, how many stars they have like the first one has really like i mean come on mate Come on, mate, bring me some, some, someone is bigger. <laughs> and what is after quadrillion? We are getting there. Um, I don't, can I can't tell what is after quadrillion. Let's go. Like even this one will defeat him. No. No, no, no. <laughs> it's not that weak. Uh, I think we just go with the additional. Yeah, so just have more. It's too bad we didn't get any uh, notification, by the way. Uh, that would have helped a lot just to get rid of like those commands that are just useless for us. I think now it will be minion, something like that. Like how much he will have. No, it's still far away. Uh, I, I don't know what is this guy. QI? I have no idea. <laughs> I will check after uh, the notions like uh, and the power system in the mathematics to see what that represent. What can really be improved here? I will drop it in Discord for the devs, but if we can just like have an option where you auto combine all the towers like i just select this one and if there is any tower like here beam just auto combine that will make those kind of build just way 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 easier to play and we can really i can just go everything like just maxed out <laughs> and maybe maybe that can be something to think about i will drop a comment and feedback on on their discord and i hope uh, they can do it if they have the capacity to do it because they have a life as well so <laughs> they might hope yeah they definitely have their own roadmap 
and I'm not sure technically how hard that will be actually to add but that's something that can really make this way easier Now, by the way, I forgot, but I have a, also one annoyance in this one. One of the trophies that I got. 21 minion. Still not there, mate. Mm -hmm. I don't have to use it yet because, like, yeah, like with three heads, we will get him four heads. And he's not getting us with four heads. So, continue without infusing. 36, whatever is that. Uh, okay, let's go. I'm just excited uh, and waiting where I want to infuse. <laughs> it would be insane. Alright, let's go. Think now we should, right? It will be go to billion, one billion, something like that. Yep, yep, buddy. Hmm. Time. It's time, ladies and gentlemen. We were waiting for this since three hours, and it's finally here. I will reroll in case I can't get to level thirty-two. So I just increase that by two, and once I'm done, we will infuse. <laughs> All right, there we go. I managed to get another level, so now 66. All right, all right. Beam! <laughs> what is that? I don't know. I can tell you that's a lot. That's all what I can tell you. All right, so we are set for, I don't know how many, how many turn we are set with this. All right. <laughs> And you are getting like back 147. Alright, we're still at billion and there are trillion after. And then there are quadrillion, then there are QI, then maybe there are the SX. So that's a long time to go. Alright, let's we is a trillion. So it's at least it's scaling uh, that much, so I'm happy <laughs> because I want to finish this. <laughs> Why am I doing this to myself? It's too bad we're just missing like really nothing to to get another level. How much? All right. Oh yeah, yeah, just, uh, yes, just buy this one and skip, because, uh, rare, well, we won't be getting the princess anyway, so, at least this is fast, <laughs> this one, I like it. <laughs> Alright, so we're getting SX now, so he's at quadrillion now. Yeah, so now he is at QI. I think like by four, maybe four, three, four turn, uh, he will get to SX. I think so. Damage. Once again, we're just missing two to get to the next level. All right. But we will gain experience, actually. But do we get the mana before? I don't think so. The experience. Get the mana. Yeah, then the experience. So we didn't get the bonus. Yeah. So Essex, uh, we're still okay because he won't be doing yeah, two hits from us and he's dead. So, how much by how much? That's the question. Um, Technically, technically, 
I can still beat it, but 2.4, have like 240 T, that means 100 attack. Do I really need to wait? <laughs> or... Ah, oh, man. That will be like 100 attack, because like 100 attack he will do how much quadrillion he will be at uh, uh, 506 QI. But I don't want to wait that much, mate. <laughs> like 100. That's a lot. That's a lot of attacks. I, I, I will just infuse, but first um, let's get... Uh, Let's get maybe another level on this, if we can. Well, too bad, we didn't get any level, uh, so we just go infuse in here. No brainer. SP. Hmm. SP is the next thing. So I got a lot of uh, HP. I don't know what's happened here. So far, they were just about the same. But here it seems that just I gain a lot of HP. Alright. I would one shot him. Is this a good thing or a bad thing? Having uh, more attack than HP? I can't recall. But normally it's 50-50. It's like it's... Uh, uh, the infusing is 50-50. It's either one or the other. So, we'll find out. <laughs> Let's continue. So here I want to fuse because we are getting him easy. Um, even though it will take some time. It will take some time. Because that's a lot of attacks. I know how many attacks, but that's a lot of attacks. Let's see. Ding, 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 ding. Yeah, it's going down. Our life is not moving. Because, like, it's uh, three attacks where they win 1.2 HP. So, that's just uh, a, lot of, a lot of damage compared to the damage that he's doing. Mm. So, now it's another story. Because OC... Uh, now I have to infuse. Because OC is like one... Like, <laughs> SX... Like 1000 of SX, it will give um, OC. Uh, we should be able to defeat him though. Uh, so let's do it. Let's, let's get it rolling. Alright, let's see how much we'll be getting now. So that's not a lot. That's definitely not a lot. Can we survive? Or should I use this one? So this one... Don't give him that. What? Why it's not moving? Is it giving like 10%? Uh, hello? Is this bugged or what? I'm not, I'm not... What is this? Seriously. I think it's bugged, no? I use more than like 10, so that's. So, select a tower on the field, you can only select from tower or level 5 or higher. Okay, the select tower will gain plus 10 damage and HP and then increase its damage and HP by 10%. So, 100% should put me at here like what 13.6 damage, which is not the case. We, we, we do agree, right? It's not the case though. Uh, so I'm kind of disappointed here. To be honest with you guys, I'm really disappointed here. Seriously. Okay, I will I will report this bug. Uh, there is no reason to continue because yeah, it's just not moving. We are just seems they are getting only like ten percent, and any, unless I'm mistaken, something, but. Then and then it's damage in HP by 10% increased. I mean, it's it's simple English, right? <laughs> All right. Um, I'm not sure if we'll survive this one. Let's see. It might take some time, take a while to to do this one. So. Uh, 
Oh, that's a lot. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I might just go. Uh, you know what? I will prepare uh, my tea. I'm coming back. Oh, I defeated him. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, they don't think this time we can defeat him, for sure. I don't think so. And you know what? I want to reroll here. I just not we won't be getting that much far getting I think to the limits of this. So I mean this one it's made it's uh, anyway, it was a fun one <laughs> I'm recording. Like overall I think this took seven, eight hours. I'm record this is like over three days and I still have to do the editing. I already started doing some parts. But uh, I don't know when, when I will drop this one. Anyway, it gets confusing. And we just skip. Because I'm not sure. I don't want to do the math anymore. <laughs> I'm tired. I swear to God. Alright. Are we cooked? I think I cooked. Uh, yeah, definitely I cooked. Yeah, so it's, it wasn't worth it to... Anyway, to just throw it all there. Because, uh, I mean, you won't be getting a that much more like we are not even getting his hp down or whatever yeah <laughs> so this is this is the limit of this build it was quite fun it was quite fun and i might do it there with the uh, efreet and genie because uh, uh they have also some bonus uh depends the, um, the mana infuse one gets more damage and one gets more hp and um, but I don't know how much they scale when they level up them because I just never um, done that with them. But let me know in the comments if <laughs> this kind of run uh, are interested. And if it's the case, then I might give it a try. And here we go. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> I'm happy. I mean, <laughs> new record for the Inferno 79. I'm really happy actually that this is done. <laughs> All right, boys. I hope this was fun also for you. And if it's the case, please give us a like, subscribe. It means a lot. To keep me pushing and posting this kind of stuff, this kind of fun. And in the meantime, have fun, take care, and see you for the next one.